Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and today I will be talking about the applications of trigonometric functions or we also call it problem solving involving trigonometric functions. Okay, here we go. I have here an example of a problem solving involving trigonometric functions wherein we are going to illustrate the given information and solve what is asked. So here's the problem, a 9 meter ladder re rests against the side of the wall, the bottom of the ladder is 1.5 meters from the base of the wall. Determine the measure of the angle between the ladder and the ground to the nearest degree. So first thing first is we are going to illustrate this information. Okay. So the first thing is a 9 meter ladder rests against the side of the wall. So I have here an illustration. This is the wall and this is the ladder. Okay. And remember that the ladder is 9 meters so that's how are we going to represent this okay so a 9 meter ladder and then the bottom of the ladder is 1.5 meters from the base of the wall okay so how where are we going to write this so from the bottom or from the foot of the ladder to the base from the base of the wall that is 1.5 meters okay so take note of that it is very important here to emphasize very carefully those uh, informations there in the problem. The next one is determine the measure of the angle between the ladder and the ground. So how are we going to represent this? This is the one that is missing. So this is the angle, the one between the ladder and the ground. Okay? And we can represent this one by x or any variable. Now in this case, remember, so katoa. Okay? sine opposite over hypotenuse cosine with ad adjacent over hypotenuse tangent opposite over adjacent with respect to x here this 1.5 remember what is this this is the adjacent side okay and this is the nine nine meter here is opposite to the right angle and therefore this is the hypotenuse so in that case x is 1.5 over 9 which is adjacent over hypotenuse therefore it's cosine Dividing both sides by cosine, solve it algebraically. Remember that this dividing by cosine that can be represented by cosine to the power of negative 1. Through the power of the calculator, the value of x there is equal to 80 degrees because it says here nearest degree. Okay? So guys, that is how are we going to apply the concept of Sokotoa in a problem solving. Okay? And that's it guys. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.